What's going on guys? Connor here. My buddy Ryan's behind the camera. And today we're going to bring you a review of my pretty much brand new Giant Trance. And this is the 3 version. So it's the cheaper one of the Trance series. $2,100. But for the specs and components you get on this bike, it's well worth it. So let's get into it. For the front fork, we've got a RockShox Sector. It's got a multi-stage lockout, which is pretty nice. Right here, just twist that. All the way is locked out, halfway for like trails and full out for rough stuff. The damper is on the bottom. And for the rear shock, we've got the RockShox Monarch R. The only thing I have to complain about this shock is that it doesn't come with a rear lockout, so when you're on those hills, it's going to be harder than a hardtail. But when I was on the hills, how the Maestro suspension works is really nice. I didn't really feel a difference. For the drivetrain, we've got Dior, which is nice. Bugs all around here. For the transmission, we've got a 2x10 with a rear derailleur with a Dior clutch derailleur which is nice and this dropper post I actually put on after I bought it so this version does not come with a dropper but the Trance 2 does and this is just the KS E10 dropper post it's about $110 well worth it it works great and yeah for the tires, we've got the Schwalbe Knobby Nix. These tires provi provide a lot of traction, and I'm really enjoying this bike. For the rear disc brakes, we've got 160 mil on the rear, and the front's 180 mil, which is generally how they are. For the brakes, we've got just Shimano. I can't even honestly tell you which ones it is but it's the hydraulic ones and it's got internal cable routing which is nice I mount I mounted this dropper post externally because the cable wasn't quite long enough for me to get an internal routing which kind of bummed me out but it was all right 140 mil in the front for the front fork and 140 in the rear and yeah, I'm really enjoying this bike so far. Well worth the money in my opinion. If you're a new enduro or trail rider that wants to start getting out there, this would be the bike for you. And yeah, so that's going to be it for this video, guys. We are going to try and push out some video, a couple videos a week. Try and get the channel growing. And yeah, we'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.